What's up guys, it's Brian again from Lake Acres Scuba Marina. Got another search and recovery coming for you today. Uh, today we are after a pair of reading glasses for a lady who dropped them off a dock. We believe it's only about 10 foot of water, so it's not very deep at all. But we're gonna head out to see if we can find these. And I'm not sure if you guys know just how many of these dives we do in a year's time frame. This week alone, this is my seventh dive or search and recovery dive this week alone. So, you know, that's one a day is what we average throughout the summer. But if it's something that you're wanting to get into, please seek out proper training. Don't just get your open water cert and go jump in the water and start doing this because it can be dangerous, especially if you're working in an overhead environment. So make sure you get properly trained. Get your open water cert, get your search and recovery cert, your night diver cert, your buoyancy cert, and there's a slew of other ones. Navigation really helps me out a lot when I'm doing these dives, but make sure you get trained properly. And my camera's falling here, but I'm gonna jump into water here shortly. Hopefully I'll have a successful search, and then I'll give you some final thoughts on this at the end. So this is my light here. Oh, okay. All right, let's see what we can find for you. Thank <laughs> you. 
not sure if those are yours neither. <clears throat> and you got a net or something down here. Is that them? All right. Let me grab this net. Are you missing like a net on a pole like what you got up there? Let me grab it for you too. found them I found that the small pair that pair literally as soon as I hit the bottom and then I swam for about two minutes and found those and then I actually saw that as soon as I went down but after I found your glasses like yeah that's got to be them because it's got the sunglass clip on part and I thought well she did mention there was other glasses so I just circled a couple times just to see they wasn't far out oh probably are yeah Thank you, dear. It means a lot. Alright guys, so we just got out of the water. We had a very successful surge. Wasn't too difficult of a surge. Um, got a little bit more information from the lady about our glasses, what we were looking for. Uh, ended up finding two pair. One was a cheaper pair of sunglasses for. Also found her husband's fishing net that he had there, the little net that they used to get stuff out of the water with. So yeah, all in all, it was a decent search. Um, hopefully it showed up on camera. The first thing I did here though was, is I tried to set up my compass because they wasn't quite sure how far out in the lake or how far off from the dock she was when she lost it. So I set up my compass so that I could run a navigation uh, search if I needed to. Ended up doing a reverse jack stay. I actually started shallow and then started working a little bit deeper where typically on a jack stay search, I would go from the deepest point up. But I did a reverse jack stay here. I come across a cheap pair of sunglasses for her. Then I found her uh, reading glasses with the sunglasses built in. And then of course I found his net as well. But all in all, great search. If you got any questions on today's search, simply put it down in the comment section below and I'll try to answer it the best I can. Uh, once again, guys, if you want to see more of these videos that are commentated, let me know down below and I'll walk you through step by step everything that I'm doing there in these searches. And hopefully that'll help you out with your searches in the future. But yeah, like I said, don't forget about your continuing education courses. They will help you. Navigation, search and recovery, night diving, deep diving, buoyancy control. Uh, there's a lot of classes that will help you be more successful during your search and recovery operations. But guys, if you like this video, smash that like button for me. Share it if you will. As always, guys, make sure you follow us on Instagram and Twitter. Like us on Facebook. Pin us on Pinterest. Subscribe to us here on YouTube. And as always, guys... We appreciate your business. Guys, we really appreciate you watching our videos. If you liked it, make sure to give us a big thumbs up. If you're not a subscriber, simply hit that subscriber button for us and make sure you hit the little bell to turn on all notifications. If you want to see some other cool videos, make sure to click these links here. They could be scuba tips, they could be diving videos, search and recovery videos, or gear reviews. Once again, guys, we really appreciate it.